Hi guys, welcome to our very first official video, other than the intro. Um, our first video is going to be Game Dev Tycoon, as you can see. Now, as you can read here, welcome to Game Dev Tycoon. In this business simulation, you have... Thanks, David. But... It's basically about growing your own website, like gaming company for game games, like Dishonored and all that. We are pretty much just come up with really absurd parody names. Like yeah. I mean, last time we had something like Hotman, absolutely. <laughs> or something like that. Company name, U Box. I mean, it doesn't fit. There you go. I'm a bitch. Ah, that's probably the only hero. Uh, that'll do. Um, my rulers. No, that's game over. Sorry, no more mind rollers. You are dead. No. Right. So basically, we're gonna start developing our very first game. I think we'll go with. Hotman, absolutely. Oh, I want to make Hot a man. remix of the Wii. Oh yeah, uh, The Legend of Delta. Delta. Yes, The Legend of Delta. Okay, pick topic. Fantasy. Pick genre, adventure. Pick platform. Uh, PC. PC, you've always got to be a PC. Right, 2D graphics. Sometimes the text-based graphics can do good. Alright, we want high engine. Gameplay around the middle, story and quest right up there. Because, you know, Zelda is quite a story-based game. Yeah, the very first, like, the first ten games, like, the first ten games you develop will be... No, um, but the first ten games that you make will be randomised, like um, reviews, instead of being like real world based. This this most probably will be a series, David. Right, we have a few bugs with the game, so we've got to wait for our guy to finish. And finish. One more. Okay, no finish. What? Right. We've got some cool XP out of that. Yeah. Whatever you spent the most on, like whichever one you put up the highest, will be the one that gets the most most XP off of I I leveled up as a person well I haven't leveled up but I got yeah, XP, XP right let's release the game right the game reviews come on please be good oh oh my oh, god that's yeah. quite good for a very first game come on yeah it's gonna be like seven six seven six Oh, be bro. We, we, ha we, have to, we have to make a sequel. Yes. Yeah, you have to. Rackman Championship, a newcomer in the game industry, has released their first game. We're gonna gain some awesome fans. Right, this tells you how well we're doing after a month. After a month, yeah. 26 fans. 
Whoa. Whoa. 26 fans on the we first month. We are doing good. Yeah, for a very first game. And uh, after months, it's becoming slightly more. Yeah, that happens in the real world too. Yeah. Like the crisis series, they started off really high. After a year, people were becoming bored with the game, so they released a second just to pop the charts back up, and then it was becoming to dull down. And then, crisis three, boom, over the roof. And then it fell off the roof because it was clumsy. Yeah, then the roof just like collapsed, because because there was like three massive holes in them. Yeah, and they made things like Warhead and that, didn't they? Yeah, that didn't go too well. No, they, they did. They did brilliant. I don't even know anymore. Alright, we should make a sequel called The Legend of Zelda. The, the Phantom no, Ballglass. The Zinderbreaker. Yeah, that's what we should call it. What's that a sequel of? Windbreaker. Oh, yeah. I can't remember. I want to make a sequel of Mario, like... Oh, uh, Dari... Super... Super Mario Bros. Yeah. if if you're too stupid... Hold on, we can make Surgeon Sim. Go back. Look. Surgery. Call it... Call it Surgeon Sim. Sim 2014. No, that's not the that that's not the year in the Dragon. game. This is 2001 apparently. Platform. It's not because it said 35 years until mm. the present day. Oh. We we're just gonna have a little bit of fun with this. We got some copyright claims before, but I sorted them out. Story and quest can be like zero. You want gameplay and engine to be up there. Because let's be honest, Surgeon Sim. That's all the it only really story is. You get is Bob hurt himself. Oh, we should have made it Lurgeon Sim. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna ignore this. Yeah, we, we they're gonna fail. They're just we, gonna we be like. We played later Ooh. on in the game, and we know that that's gonna fail. That's why we're not using them PC mainly. Until you want, you want, here's a little tip: follow PC for until the TES comes out. Stay with that for a while, and then move on to Nintendo stuff. Why do you want AI? Oh, you got to have a fair bit, so the player's all right. Dialogue's not that much. There's no dialogue in it. Yeah, there is. If you get the spy modification, uh, no, the medic. TF2 medic modification for it. Anyway, you want graphics to be up there? They want it all to be up there. Yeah, but it costs more money. Eee! Alright, wait for them bugs to go down. Waiting for them bugs, you know. Oh, this, this should do well. Oh. We've got a fair bit of XP if out of it, see? If that's how we did in real life, then we should do well. Yeah. People still play it. Well, yeah, it's now on, it's now on the phone, Stuart. Is it? Yes. Oh, I didn't know that. It is an app, I think. <laughs> Nimento, here we go. Yeah, go for the TES first. Wow. <laughs> and you thought owl parodies were bad. Come on. Hold on. So we'll see how Surgeon Sim goes, and then we'll end the video because Stuart has not been paying attention. Yes, I have. We've got 30 seconds. No, we can mix two videos together. Fun at stages. Fails and falls a bit short. So once these are finished, I'm sorry to say it's a goodbye from me and a goodbye from David. It called it beautiful. Goodbye everybody! See you later guys.